Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to e-commerce know-how. Here are seven proven ways to grow e-commerce sales by 50% or more. Number one, streamline your inventory management. Another way to grow your e-commerce profits is through better inventory forecasting and inventory management. If you can accurately predict the amount to reorder and when to reorder it, then you can save big on shipping costs. For example, SoStocked, an Amazon inventory management software, helped one customer save $150,000 annually by streamlining their inventory. Before using inventory management software, the customer kept running out of stock and would place expensive last minute reorders that cost $1.20 to ship via air. Once the customer dialed in their inventory management, they could correctly time the reorders and draw shipping costs down to 0.45 to 0.55 per unit. With savings like that, exponential growth can be achieved by reinvesting the profits to scale quickly and profitably. In your purchasing team, optimize supply. Number two, partner with other companies. Find a related e-commerce website and partner with them. This is one of the easiest and most affordable marketing strategies to grow your business. For instance, you can offer a discount to all the customers of your partner website when they come to buy your products via your partner. Guidance, resources, and tools you need to unlock the full potential of win-win partnerships. With Number three, sell to current customers. Find methods of improving sales to the customers you currently have. This is a lot more affordable than finding new customers because you already know that they love your product. One method of doing this is by giving discounts. For example, if your cost of the production is not very high, you can offer discounts like buy one, get one free. Also, you can offer loyalty rewards by giving customers loyalty cards and titling them to free services or products for every 10 things they buy. This is a common technique that really works. If doing this has not crossed your mind, it's a good idea to include it in your online e-commerce business to boost sales and profits. Each product to wholesalers and manufacturers. Number four, target other groups. Do not just focus on your main target audience. Expand your targeting efforts and find new customers from other groups. For example, when your primary target market includes students in college, you might want to begin expanding to other markets such as teens. For those who sell stay-at-home moms, have you considered maybe selling to working moms? Number five, offer complimentary services or products. Once you've found a service or a product that other people truly love, don't skip on the potential of selling other items and accessories related to that product. This is also known as upselling. Not only will your customers get a broader selection of products, they will also most likely be more attracted to your products. This will especially appeal to customers who tend to love stocking up on a product line versus just a single item. Gates are monitored with a high voltage gate switch, which if forced open, generates an alarm. The Number six, market most popular products. Take the time and effort to focus on promoting, selling, and marketing your popular products. You already have statistics that prove these products to be winners, so your marketing efforts will not go to waste. Actually, it will increase the sales and conversions of your online store. Even though it can be tempting to try and market all your products, it usually is more profitable and less risky to pick a few products that you trust and use them to bring traffic to the store. Our automated systems are easy to operate and predict failures before they occur. Working smarter just got... Number seven, bank outside the box. Think outside the box to find other strategies that will attract customers to your store. Like, have you thought of turning your e-commerce business into a business or franchise opportunity? Does your business fit this model? While most businesses online tend to remain small in scope, you might find that yours can potentially be a wholesale distribution or a franchise. You can also find other ways of selling such as through affiliate networking and the like. Thinking creatively and finding more ways your business can make money is highly rewarding for your e-commerce store and business growth. Market your store and they will come should be your new mantra. And by using these seven strategies, you will definitely grow your business. However, sometimes you need to question the norm and learn to ask why. Some of these systems may have worked for years, but might not be your solution. Mark's up. This brings us to the end of our video. Hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.